this is our 50th anniversary this year. In the late 60s, early 70s, Congress ultimately decided that there was a need for an organization that could work with the public and the private sector together to help address the problems of our built infrastructure and how to do things responsibly, use science and technology, bring those elements to bear on the building process. So, you know, here we are 50 years later and NIB's work has been around looking at the building and looking at buildings in the built environment holistically. There's a lot of other organizations that are part of the federal government that help to address um, performance in our built infrastructure, the National Academies of Science, uh, Federal Facility Council, for example, or the um, uh, National Institute of Standards and Technology, for example, do a lot of work in building science, but they tend to do studies that are research related and NIBS is unique in bringing together consultants from the private sector to work with government to do projects that address a specific problem around implementation. So there's some very interesting and practical things that NIBS helps to facilitate. And our session here on the built environment and the BIM storm to use AI and digital twins is really trying to continue that trend to explore where we can apply technology to help improve the way our facilities are operated and how efficient and effective they are and safe and secure they are and um, have as little impact as possible on the environment. 